are starting to hit the dog days of summer, but there is still plenty of time for families to gather for that summertime classic, the backyard barbecue. Whether it's a small gathering or a large family reunion, firing up the grill is just the first step in making great memories with family and friends. Here to give us some great tips on making those gatherings even better is Chef G. Garvin. Good morning, Chef. Hey, how are you, Amy? How you doing? I am good. Looks like you are grilling up something spectacular over there, right? Oh, yeah. Ain't no fun if you ain't barbecuing. <laughs> All right. Well, what in your mind makes a great summer barbecue party? Well, you know, there's a couple of great things that makes a summer barbecue party. If you take a look at my table, it's really all about the food. It's about the family. It's about the friends. It's about the loved ones coming together and really enjoying the last few days of summer. So it's, it's really great. All right, and I got the pool behind you so you can take a dip and then still get out and check on your chicken, right? Take a dip in the pool, <laughs> cool off, have a little go peak tea, Ooh. hydrate, and jump right back to the grill, baby. All right, well, speaking of the grill, give me some of your recipes because I know you make food fabulous. What do you have for us this morning? Ah, uh, you got to try the short ribs. Unbelievable with the homemade barbecue sauce. Of course, I got some bone-in chicken thighs with the skin on because I want to grill them, get that really great char on that skin. Uh, I've got some marinated uh, chicken thighs as well. Garlic shrimp skewers, throw them on the skewers, some fresh garlic, a little olive oil. Um, and of course, I love veggies, so we got some really good vegetable kebabs here. Um, and we got some lobster mac and cheese oh. that'll put you to the other side. Oh, yeah, it'll take it to the other side. It just, it's incredible like that. It's unbelievable. And of course, we finish it with some donut bread pudding. Ooh. Ha. Some what? What are we finishing that mm -hmm. with? That's some donut bread pudding. Now, anybody can make bread pudding, but it's all about the donut bread pudding that makes it really great. Oh, that looks so good. So what did you put in that bread pudding? Besides the donuts, obviously, oh, right? <laughs> yeah, well, donuts and, of course, the custard. Um, and it's really great. I, we actually take some gold PT and reduce it down with a little brown sugar, babe. Ooh. And we make a little drizzle. We go right over the top with a little whipped cream <laughs> and a little fresh mint. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right. And any yeah. other suggestions for our guests? What can elevate your party to that next level? Well, it's really about making some great sauces, some great marinades and seasoning really well. And I got to tell you, if you want to go to the next level, you got to keep that lobster, no-bake mac and cheese in mind. It's things like that that set you apart. You can do uh, potato salad, uh, pasta salad. But when you go to the next level with, like, the no-bake mac and cheese and the donut bread pudding, it really sets you apart. So you can have a barbecue, your neighbor can have a barbecue, but it all depends on what's on the barbecue. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> yes. You crack me up. I like you, man. You need to come and do a barbecue in my backyard I crack you and have up. some fun. <laughs> yes. Anytime, Amy, anytime. Uh, in Tennessee. Tennessee. Well, tell me what, where can our viewers go to get some of these fabulous recipes like that no-bake lobster macaroni and cheese? I have got to try that. You got to go to goldpeakt.com. And Amy, while you're there, I want you to check out a really great contest Gold Peak Tea is doing. We know that you have family all over the country. And what we want to do is we want to make sure we get somebody back home for the holidays. So it's take me home for the holidays. Submit a photo. Tell us a really great story. And we want to make sure we help someone get home to the ones they love. So it's a double whammy. Goldpeakt.com for the recipes and a really great contest, okay? Hey, that contest. Let me know how it goes. Sounds fabulous, and I am going to try some of those recipes. Chef, thank you so much for taking the time out to chat with us this morning. You got it. Shrimp skewers on the way out. Mm, Holla. Send them my way. You like that, huh? You like that. <laughs> the preceding portion of daytime was sponsored by...